Well, police are investigating after authorities found two bodies in a Baldwin home. The Power of Two's Laura Simon is live in Baldwin with the latest on this discovery. Laura. Blair, good morning to you. A shocking discovery to say the least. And right now the investigation is still very early, but Baldwin police made this grim discovery after a mail carrier noticed that the home where those bodies were found, the mail had been piling up, looked like it hadn't been collected in quite some time. So the mail carrier called police asking for them to do a welfare check. We want to show you some video where police were out there last night investigating this whole situation here. The mail carrier again noticed that the mail was piling up in the mailbox at this home here on Sunny Slope Drive. This is located just about two miles away from the police department where we're reporting to you from here this morning. And the mail carrier did call police between three and four yesterday afternoon requesting that welfare check. This is a quiet subdivision, so neighbors were pretty shocked by this. Officers got access to that home, making the grim discovery of the two bodies inside. And given the condition that they found the bodies in, the medical examiner is going to have to perform an autopsy to determine these people's identities and their exact causes of death. Right now, it's unclear if anything criminal is going on in this situation or if this is a suspicious case in nature. So at this point in time, we're still working to gather those details. Police have not released the names, genders, or ages of those two people who died. But Baldwin is a calm St. Louis suburb with a population of around 31,000 people. So you can imagine a lot of people are wondering what exactly happened to those two people. I am working to find that out. I have placed some texts and calls out to police here this morning. And as soon as we get an update, we'll be sure to let you know. Reporting live here in Baldwin this morning, Laura Simon, Fox 2 News.